Hi, I am Cesar Santos. Do you find this drawing insulting? After the success of my portrait painting video, I was requested by my Facebook community to do an instructional video on how I went about drawing the whole human figure. As we were filming the process, I shared some of the studies I was doing for the video. The gesture drawing, the plane composition throughout the figure, the anatomy studies with all the muscles describing the form, other line drawings that I was doing. As I finished my drawing, I decided to post it so my friends and clients could see the result. I was excited to show it. That same day, after hundreds of comments, messages, and positive, beautiful feedback, I get a note from Facebook saying that my image was taken down because I violated the community standards of Facebook. I immediately responded to Facebook to check that case again because that was a drawing on paper. It's an artistic expression and I didn't break any of the Facebook rules. The following day, I got this positive message from them saying that it was their mistake and that they would put the, the drawing back. Someone kept reporting my drawing and Facebook, the following day, completely blocked my whole account. I was sure this was a mistake, so while they were fixing it, I was kind of waiting, and suddenly I get an email stating that my account was permanently blocked. Yeah, we're back in the 1500s or something when Daniele da Volterra had to cover the nudes of Michelangelo for the Pope. I could have easily kept blaming them, especially at Facebook, for not even giving me an opportunity to say my part. I was convicted and punished without a trial and that ended up damaging my business I was doing through Facebook and Messenger. How dangerous it is for a, such a powerful company as Facebook to side with the aggressor, with the bully. I want to remind everyone that any negative experience can be turned into a positive one. In order to grow, in order to become a better version of who we are at the moment, we have to accept and welcome the challenge. Because a challenge will either make you fail or succeed. If you succeed, no problem, you just keep moving forward. But if you fail against a particular challenge, that just means that you were not as prepared as you thought you were. That means that you need to get better at something specifically so that the next time you encounter the challenge, you have a better chance, a better option for winning. If someone wants to silence me and my art, how can I make an even louder statement, especially because I felt I was in the right? I was motivated to start a series of blogs in which I could express my thoughts as well as show my art and have a better communication with the audience. This channel is the result of that negative experience, this challenge that I decided to take in a positive direction. Don't get discouraged, don't avoid opposition, don't ask for protection the whole time. Welcome the challenge, keep growing, keep moving forward, keep aiming at the light. I remember this from my vines in my garden that even though I keep trimming them, they keep growing back stronger and stronger. That's the greatest lesson from nature. If you want to witness my whole process of how I did this drawing from start to finish, you can see every mark I made on the paper, every thought that came to my mind. It's an extensive video, it's called Secrets of Figure Drawing. I'll put the link in the description below. By the way, I almost forget to say that this drawing on display is here to stay. Don't take me for prey, I offer rebirth like the month of May. Oh, and that's a wrap.